Hey guys, it's Quinn, and today we'll be taking a look at the eighth film with Rocky in it. Jeez, it's been eight. Creed 2. Creed 2 pits now heavyweight champion of the world Creed versus Ivan Drago's son in a battle which pretty much mirrors the plot of Rocky 3 with the characters of Rocky 4. I think I should start by saying that I do not think that this film is as good as the first Creed. In every way that the first Creed is its own spin on the Rocky franchise with unique subplots and original characters, Creed 2 feels more in line with the formula of the franchise. There is definitely originality in this film that I don't want to spoil, and I think that that's a lot of what makes the film a lot of fun, but it pales in comparison to the first one. The way I would describe the two is that the first Creed feels like Skyfall, you know, really new and fresh. Whereas Creed 2 feels like Spectre. I really liked Spectre, but I just think Skyfall is definitely superior. Here's why. Have you guys seen Rocky 3? Then I swear to God you know the entire plot of this film. Have you guys seen Rocky 4? Then great, you know every character. It's as simple as that. I know it's ironic coming from a Bond fan that I'm bagging on repetitiveness in a film franchise. It's just, it was very glaring here. There are a few other slight complaints I have. The dialogue at times was incredibly clunky. There was one exchange in particular where Rocky and Creed are talking about fighting young Drago outside of Rocky's apartment, which, if you've seen the film, I think you will agree it feels like two actors reading a script. Also, some of the drama was kind of in the realm of who gives a shit. But... This film has a lot really going for it. The plots and fighting montages are awesome. Particular shout out to the clip of Drago's son doing pull-ups with three plates tied to his waist. I mean, that was, that was awesome. I also enjoyed that we got further development of Ivan Drago and what happened to him after Rocky IV. It's cool they spent time developing a character which I feel the fans care more about than most of the other characters in the series. Stallone was his normal acting self in the film, but I like how he continues to really own the role as Rocky. As for the plot, although Rocky III comes front and center in my mind while watching this film, Rocky III probably had the most interesting plot in the, uh, in the franchise, which I think is also true of Creed II as well. It has a very interesting plot. Overall, Creed set a bar so high that it would have been hard for Creed 2 to reach it. Creed 2 was very entertaining, though, regardless. Fun fight scenes, interesting characters and development, some actual pretty funny moments. The theater was really laughing a lot throughout, and a good amount of Rocky theme song trickled throughout as well. I'll tell you this, though. You could make a pretty aggressive drinking game out of every time Rocky says something that sounds deep but makes no sense in this film. Anyways, yeah, this film is a good time, but don't expect it to surpass the first film. I would give it a 7.8 out of 10. So what do you guys think of Creed 2? What is your favorite film in the franchise? For me, it's probably Rocky 4. I don't know, something about him killing communism was pretty entertaining to me. Whatever it may be, leave it in the comment section below. And as always, like, share, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Ciao.